What's up guys, welcome back to the Johnny Q channel. It's your boy Johnny Q. In today's video, a little bit of a different video because I'm unboxing slash showing you my new gun. Here's the unboxing, I hope you guys enjoy it. I love this look by the way, I love that color. I mean, I think it's it's pretty nice. I think it's like the FDE color, if I'm not mistaken, maybe. But uh, let's open it and see what's inside. <laughs> this is probably pretty different for most of you because you're like, where are the paint videos? Well, it's a gun video today. <laughs> All right, here it is. This is this is the Glock 19X, as you can see here in its beauty. Uh, it's got two extended mags. You can see one here, one there and then one normal 17 round. I believe there's two more rounds in here. So instead of 17, it gives you a total of 19, I believe. 19 plus one in the chamber makes it a total of 20. So you got the beaver tails if need be. These beaver tails you can put at the end of your handle here, your grip, just so it fits your size. I just have the standard one. I always go standard. So there's that a little bit of brush. Another tool here, got your manual underneath and then got your locking mechanism, of course, under. I don't use these because I have my own, but yeah. Before you go off in the comments, everything is unloaded. It's, it's clear, we're good to go. So there is the Glock 19X. It's a beautiful color, beautiful colorway. I love that look, dark earth color to it. It's really military-esque. So first impressions off the 19X for those of you who have been wanting a 19X or have wanted to shoot one or go buy one. Uh, so my first impressions is that I love the handle. It handles very, very well. It fits in my hands very, very well. Uh, it almost, it does fit like a glove. And I only say that because I do run with a Glock 17 Gen 5 and the 19X is exactly that. It's got the 17 handle. So that's why it's like, it just feels really nice. Even without the extended mag, right? If you just put in a regular mag, it still fits like a glove. I mean, it's got that 17 Gen 5 handle, which I love. And the barrel, actually, I, I believe it fits a lot better in my hands only because the barrel isn't that long. Next to a 17 Gen 5, this is actually a lot shorter because on the 19X, the barrel is actually based off the 19. No, the Glock 19, and so that's why it just it just feels a lot better. And especially when when you go when you go to shoot, there's not as much recoil as I thought there would be. I've shot this gun one time. Uh, actually, I, I've been to the range one time and I shot this several times. But uh, overall, man, I would say it's it's classy. I will tell you that much. Another thing that I do like about uh, this 19X is it's got the Ambi slide release. So you can get it on this side. You can also go on and release it. I can get it, there you go, on that side. So uh, very, very uh, well thought out. Also Ambi uh, mag release on this side. I usually, you know, I usually go over here, so. But as far as like the like the weight to carry ratio, the, the way it feels in your hand, the way it does shoot, I mean, it shoots like a dream. Uh, I would say that it's on par with shooting the Glock 17 and the 19. Well, I mean, it's both in one, it's one and the same, of course, but when you go to shoot, it doesn't feel like a 19. It doesn't feel like a 17. It really just feel like, it, it feels like it's its own class of weaponry. And I really love that. I mean, at, at, at this point, I have no complaints about this gun. As far as weight goes, uh, I mean, I. Like I said, it's really in between a 19 and a 17, but for the most part, it just, it literally lays so well. It feels amazing uh, when, when you grip it, when you're handling it with both hands, you have, you feel like you're in control of your weapon versus sometimes I feel like on a 19, I mean, you're still in control, but if you have bigger hands, I mean, I think I have medium sized hands, but if you have bigger hands, it's almost like you're overpowering uh, that 19 versus on a 17, you're kind of, you know, if you have medium to smaller hands, you're kind of almost fighting the weapon and its recoil. But on this 19X, I'm telling you, it's it's like the best of both worlds. It just fits. You can see I'm covering the entire uh, gun here and I'm just handling it super well. Go to easy, uh, easy mag release, put it back in there, draw, 
point shoot. I can reach that mag release with my thumb very, very easily. Put it back in there. Got the extended mag. Love the extended mag too, because if you want to somehow have a lower grip on with your left hand, I mean, you can, you have that space. And as you can see, they actually, it looks like they put like a little indent here. Uh, as you can see right up there, little indent so that you can potentially put maybe another finger if you have bigger hands. Uh, I have medium sized hands, so I don't really need to use that, but it's there and it could be helpful for some of you. So yeah, if you've been on the fence about a 19X, please don't be on the fence no more. I'm telling you, Johnny Q, the art guy is telling you right now, go get yourself a 19X because you will not regret it. So you have plenty of fun on the range. It's gonna be great for you. That is it for today's video. I just wanted to show you the new uh, gun that I now own. I wanted to unbox it with you guys and kind of share maybe this new venture that I might go on and just unbox different guns, talk about them, maybe go shoot them on the range uh, and show them to you. But hope you guys liked it and uh, make sure to go get a Glock 19X. Oh, and this video is not sponsored at all by Glock. They're not paying me to say this. This is uh, me purchasing this with my own money. I go out on the range, shoot it with my own ammo, and I give you a solid review. So it's not really a review video, but kind of my first impressions of the 19X. So hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.